Lord have mercy, we look like the clamp that's going down the daggone road. I got my buddy Mark up here in the service truck, Michelle's up here in the Jeep. I'm up here on the hill where old Mark used to live here, and uh, I'm moving a little steel. I'm gonna get me a little junk. Y'all know how it goes. Got her. I got a, got a pinion on there, and uh, let's see how long that lasts. Got a gravely and a pinion out of a triple seven, the whole third member. Uh, several air tanks, all kinds of stuff. Did they make your Yeah, Bubba, she looks good. I'm a smooth driver. You see that pop can sitting on that fender and they move? Yeah, y'all. We'll see if it stays on there once we get down there going through the rough stuff. It's right between the wheels. That's the problem with the wheel. Let's bounce a little point where it gets air underneath it. Yeah, that's a good thing there. That's my pop. Why not bounce it a little way then? About half full. I didn't realize I had all this shit, you know what? Yeah, I, I, we still ain't done. No. no. I got a camper, a bunch of steel, an air tank, bolts, nuts, pumps, all kind of shit. Lord have mercy, you get back from Texas, we're gonna be busy for a whole Saturday. You ought to take a Saturday off. Uh, well, we'll get here pretty soon. We'll make this shit easy. Come up one or two hours. Give a couple inches. We'll clean that out of there. Probably take Saturday to move that camper. Yeah. Uh, who's going to drive that? What am I going to do? Drive your truck up here or drive a camper home? Or how are we going to do that? I'll drive, just drive the camper home. We can do that. We might drive up when we get out of there, though. Yeah, because we're going to have to have your truck to get it out of work set. No, it, we can drive it out of there. Really? Oh yeah. I drove it in there. Yeah, but going downhill's easier than going uphill. What do you mean? Going downhill. When you drove it in it was going downhill. When you buy when you bring it out, you're gonna have to bring it uphill unless there's a road cutting over the hill. No, just back it out of there and come right up beside the house just like we did. Well yeah, we can do that. It should come out of there. If it won't then it's all covered the point where it's no, I don't lift your property anymore. We ain't gonna do that. Yeah, I figure you're glad we finally got this stuff out of there. Yep. Yeah. And we just gotta get down here and we'll put that trailer in the garage there and uh I don't know. Find something to do to we gotta take you to the airport. Cover everything up with the tarp. Just leave all this shit on. Yeah, that sounds like a plan there. We'll get that oily tarp, we'll put the oily side to it. Yeah. Gotta get that tarp cleaned up there. We won't have to lay in oil no more. No main thing I worry about up there is that boat motor. Wouldn't have got none of that stuff right there out if it wasn't for Neil. Yeah. He really saved the day there. We wouldn't even got the trailer out of there because I don't know if his truck would have pulled it out of there. That stuff got pretty sloppy and boy, that trailer sunk when he pulled it out. Yeah. We would have done something. Getting her done now, boys. Getting her done.